Somebody made a comment and say, Pastor, so you mean that a, a, a woman should also provide? A woman should also give? Is it, where is it in the Bible? That's the question. Where is it in the Bible that the woman should also support the house? You know, there are sometimes they ask Jesus Christ some questions. I love the phraseology of Jesus. How does he answer them? You don't know the scriptures. You are ignorant. You don't know. Who said it's not in the Bible that the woman provides? Who said this? It's there. How can you be a woman? You don't even know Proverbs chapter 31. That means you don't even read your Bible. You're much involved in social media. How can you not know Proverbs 31 so well to know that Proverbs 31 woman, not just that she's a woman of virtue, what makes her a woman of virtue is that she's different from every other type of woman that is on the street. Because the Bible made a reference in the book of Proverbs to the woman on the street. It made a, a, a reference to different kinds of women and different kinds of men. How many of you know that? Proverbs, are you, are you with me? You, right. It made descriptions for a young man, the kind of woman you should follow that will destroy you. And the kind of woman you will follow and you will succeed. It's there. Oh, you see a woman that is acting promiscuous. You see a woman that is acting very reflectingly. Avoid that because many men have gone there and they were eating. They were destroyed. Dressing what? Reflectingly. Behaving what? Promiscuous. It's there. So you saw it with your two eyes. You read it and or you didn't know it. My people perish for lack of what? Is there? I said everything you need in this life is provided for you in the scriptures. You don't just know it. Then you say, no, no, no. It's just the man that needs to provide for everything. God said, yes. A man who cannot provide for his household is worse than an infidel. Never said that he exempts the woman.